a short little video of Bolesławiec in Poland when the Holmes family came out and Gary did this beautiful photo album for us as a thank you I'm going to run through it Bolesławiec Poland 2016 when all the family came out These are some pictures in the square in Bolesławiec. By the way, the square in Polish is called Renek. That's a lovely church in the middle. And again, a picture there up through the little town showing the church in the top. There we are, another picture. Loads of restaurants and bars around, uh, even more so now. Now that we've moved on to 2023, some pictures of us at the house there and on the balcony and in the streets acting daft before we probably went for a beer. Here we had at the bus stop in the village of Crushen where the house is. Waiting for the bus, take us in, very cheap bus rides in Poland. That's at a restaurant that is now closed unfortunately. And uh, a lovely place, that big table and chairs there in the garden just to represent something I don't know. <laughs> and there's in the square, another bar. This is some of the pottery that they make. And that's massive, that's probably about a metre tall. There's the old library, it is now a restaurant and bar in the square some lovely forests and woodlands and Bolosavits now these pictures picture from Wrocław uh, that's one of the oldest restaurants in Poland I'm told, I'm told but uh, it's in the centre but now it's closed 2023 some Wrocław again, that's a big church there. More pictures in Wrocław. Big glass fountain there. Very impressive. Some beautiful facade buildings. Beautiful fascias that you actually feel like they're in a Hollywood studio. There we are walking about. I think this is as we arrived in Germany. Yeah. These are some shots from Germany. Near the border, we're only 25 miles from the border. And these are in a place called Godlitz, which is a big town in Germany, but it's separated by a river. And the Polish side is called Zygorlitz, or something like that, I can't say it. This is us walking around. This is four of the ladies acting daft as usual. And this here is the bridge from the Polish side to the German side. And this yellow line here represents a border. Obviously there isn't a border there no more, but all the ladies, one leg's in Germany and one leg's in Poland. <coughs> Now this is a little restaurant on the Polish side which separates, uh, the river separates Germany and Poland. Gorlitz is a very famous beautiful town in Germany. Like I say, Zygorlitz is the other side, Polish side. This is the restaurant where I went in, a fantastic, lovely, lovely desserts and food. Half the price of going across the river into Germany. There's Germany, the garlics across the river. All having a good time. That's without the beers. There's a picture looking zoomed in. 
at the church in Garlitz. Again, some pictures in Garlitz. Oh, this is Car Patch now in the mountains of Poland. Lovely skiing resort. Now, this is on the top of the mountain which borders with Czech Republic. And to get up and down, you went on this old chairlift. However, it's now a four seat, a modern one, so it's not single. Some lovely pictures here of in the town. It's all been done up now, though. Seven years later. Now we're back into Bolas Rabbits. This hotel is called Hotel Ambassador and it's got a lovely restaurant below called Periska and we go there very often when we go into Poland. Again the square all illuminated on an evening. Absolutely gorgeous square. Let's see all the, the fronts of the buildings like Hollywood sets. So that's a big wide angle photo that Gary took with his camera. Absolutely amazing, beautiful place. Fountains in the square, bars round the square. More so now and again, this one on the left here is was the library. And now it's called the old library and it's now a bar and restaurant. Again, yeah. Now this picture here, this is the town hall or one of the council buildings, square. Now these potteries, if you can see how big that is, it's good, well over a metre. Um, the one on the roof here, that's what they make famous. Uh, it's made uh, Poland very famous, uh, Bolesławiec for its pottery, it used to be called Bunslow, hence the word Bunslow pottery, before the Germans had to give the land back to Poland and they called it Bolesławiec. Beautiful pottery. They have the best clay in Europe to make the pottery as well, all from Bolesławiec. This is a viaduct just in the centre with the river running through, apparently it's just a bit longer than River Lead in our Yorkshire. Get in the square. Now this is at the house. We're having a barbecue and absolutely sailed down with rain. So under the brolly for 10 minutes while it's settled down. That beautiful weather in Poland. In the summer it's very hot, it can get into the 40s, in the winter it can get minus 25, 30. This is on our balcony. And this is a restaurant that's now closed, Giovanni's, it was a fantastic place. Just a walk away from our house, lovely food. Unfortunately they've shut it down. And thank you very much Gary, this wonderful book. Mm -hmm.